Hi, welcome to this video tutorial. We are going to see how a shockwave flash or an SWF flash movie can be embedded in PowerPoint presentation. In the first step, let us make a flash movie. I have made this one with cool moves. It's simple, 400 by 200 pixels in size and about 11 seconds long. The movie loops here, but you can easily make it without looping. Ok, let me now open PowerPoint 2010. There are three slides here as you can see. Let me show you what the slides contain. But before that, I want to mention a couple of points. When you click the Design tab and then Page Setup, the Page Setup dialog box opens. You can make the slides for different aspect ratios on the screen. I usually suggest the 16 by 9 aspect ratio because this is what is preferred at YouTube in case you decide to upload your PowerPoint video there. Coming to the slides, the first one has this simple message. I have added some simple animation to it. The message zooms in after a delay of 0.5 seconds and then zooms out after staying for 2 seconds. Let's check out how the slide plays. In the second slide there is the flash video. Don't be alarmed by the black color. It simply shows that this is an embedded video. I inserted the video by clicking the insert tab. Then media followed by video. Here, I selected video from file. From this file container in my computer, I first chose the file type, which is Adobe Flash Media. This is the file I inserted. It is an SWF file of 4.28 KB size. You will remember I said earlier, that the duration of the flash movie is 11 seconds. But to be on the safe side, let me make to advance the slide after 13 seconds. You can do your own permutation and combination here to see what works best for your need. The third slide now. This is similar to the first slide, but there are two differences. The text message appears spirally, and then it stays. Of course, you will do whatever is ideal for your need. Ok, time now to see the presentation. And here, the presentation video plays. Hope you like it. That ends this video tutorial. Thanks for watching.